Okie dokie, we're back. This is version 0.7, 0 0.7 of the physics mod. Ricky Sims is doing a great job. He's keeping up on things. I'll put the link in the description below, but he's adjusting physics for as many of the cars as he can touch. So today we're gonna be testing out the WRC2 Polo car. Let's try it out on a dirt stage, a snow stage, and a paved stage. Let's try Argentina first. Let's do the shakedown. The shakedowns are the best. Why do I always go from like, like a Spanish accent to an Italian? I don't know. I don't really have much experience with this car. I'm also wearing the crustiest of socks. You know who sent me these? John Armstrong himself sent me a pair of his socks. So I'm, I'm wearing his socks right now. So these are actually the socks that he wore in the uh, WRC 23 reveal video. So someone could just like come in here and beat my ass while I'm taking off this jacket. I mean, I don't think anyone's actually gonna do that, but they could. Here we go, baby. Let's see Five, what this car feels like. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Interesting. So, the clutch isn't working. Wrong. Okay, the car is feeling fine. Got some nice weight two, to one, it. Two. Let me see what's going on here. Okay, the clutch is working. I don't think it's because of the mod. I mean, the car feels good. It feels like it has weight, but it feels high performance at the same time. It feels really natural. Let's go ahead and test out the Ford Fiesta and see if that car feels different than it used to as well. Okay, clutch works for this car. Interesting. Let's go back to the Polo and see if whatever issue corrected itself. Maybe something loaded in the game. Really strange. Now, I, I can't confirm that this was like this or not like this before the mod. Oh, wait. It's not working. Okay, so... Wait a second. Okay, so if you start it off in neutral and rev it up, keep the clutch in, shift the first, then you can do it, but if you let it get past, past a certain point, watch, it'll engage. Watch the car start grabbing the, right there. And you can't stall in this game. It's it's like a set of Corsa, like the first game. Like, you just can't stall. You just... Really upsetting. Uh, hopefully someone fixes that in the future. But again, I can't confirm if this is from the mod or not. Please try this out in your game and let me know if this is the case. But if it is because of the mod, Ricky, if you're watching this, please check that out and see if you can figure out what the hell is going on there. So he supposedly uh, three short for left three, medium reduced the extra grip while braking. I think it was an exaggerated effect baked into the game code, so he he altered that, I think, or turned it off. It's hard to tell, like, uh, unless you, like, do it back to back, it's, it's, it's like, is it placebo or not? I don't know. Like, it definitely feels like... Um... Something different is going on. It's like I have a flat tire. Right four into left three. And helping left into right two for left two. It's nice to be able to use the handbrake in this game after these into mods. Because right. it you literally would just like fishtail around every time you try to do anything with a handbrake in the game before these mods. At least from from what I remember. We're gonna get away from the clutch issue that I'm having. Maybe it's just me that has this issue, you know, this this game is really finicky. It's kind of like RBR 2.0, you know, um, the game's great, but like has all these weird little bugs you gotta work through to, to enjoy the game. So we're back in the Volkswagen. Now I liked it on the dirt. It felt a little bit more weighty than the Ford Fiesta. It felt a little bit more grounded too, but let's see how it feels on the pavement. Break acute hairpin right into left one, medium 30. It feels good so far. Let's try a handbrake. Hey, okay, the handbrake actually right worked four, on the pavement. 20. That's a huge right improvement. Three, you know, the pavement always felt really good in this game, but it, it does seem to feel better right now five, with these mods. Three, it feels a little bit more predictable. Right three, it feels like maybe there's like some more gravity applied on this car. Maybe that's why I'm feeling like it's more grounded. And shout out to SimDid again. You know, their equipment is, is really awesome. I, I've really been enjoying the uh, the digital dashes and the steering wheel specifically. And this is actually modeled after the Yaris GR, you know, the Rally 1 car. It brings the whole rally experience together. and It, it makes me feel one step closer 
to being inside of, you know, a half a million, million dollar car, depending on what, you know, year you choose. Let's try some snow. I'm Feeling pretty good so far. Into left four, keep in. Feels pretty logical so far. And square right widens into square left, 50. Yeah, this, into this game right, feels bumpy, really flat good. Left, into flat right. If only we had these kind of Press physics in WC23 right, slash 24, left, 300. we'd be sitting pretty as rally sim enthusiasts. Let's try Turkey. Let's do the Turkey Shakedown. I'm going to try to just do the whole stage. This is for you all that appreciate the content and stick around till the end of the video. Two, okay, we're going to have to do it like one. this. Here we go. Flat left, 100. Okay, got to be really flat careful. Over crest, we have the really harsh damage mod on to be land weird or land hard or crash into something we're gonna lose a tire we're gonna lose a part of the car okay we're doing all right so far careful right here Feels good to be able to do handbrake turns again. This game really, uh, really didn't let you before. At least before the mods. Ooh. Oh no, okay, okay, we're right. Oh, that was the left one I heard. A little bit more slick on this gravel here. Got to be careful of the handbrake usage. Just a little bit. Oh, didn't mean to dip that far in there. Yeah, the traction is definitely different on this surface, which is good. You'd expect that in a rally game. Oh, no. Oh, almost hit the... Right Big old boulder. And left three short into hairpin right. You won't find at brutal stages left, like this right in a uh, EAWC, which is unfortunate. Left, left bumpy tightens into right three over crest into flat left tightens. That was a fun little shakedown. A little bit of everything. Um, this car feels really good. Unfortunately, the, the clutch thing and not being able to launch is kind of killing it for me. But uh, I don't know how to fix that. I mean, maybe it's just my personal setup that's doing this. Please, everyone test this out before you mod it and then test it out after you mod it and let me know how, how it is. Um, we got in the top 1,000 on, on that run somehow. Like, I don't... That's crazy to me. Okay, so we checked it out. We liked it. Have a good day. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you in a future video.